Okay, get ready for some freaky magic. I will guess your age in a minute. Are you a risky person who is always up for a bet? Great! Then let's bet I'll figure out your age after asking only six simple questions. Take a calculator and a pen with a sheet of paper and let's get it rolling. But before, hit the subscribe button and ring the small notification bell to join us on the bright side of life. Number 1. Choose a number from 1 to 9. Which number is your favorite? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10? 10 doesn't count. I said 1 to 9, remember? <laughs> Pick the one you like the most. Remember to write it down on the paper so that it doesn't slip your mind later. This number will be X. Alright, question number 2. Multiply your number by 2. So, X multiplied by 2. Well, that's simple. I won't even need my calculator. Question 3. Now, you need to add 5 to your result. That's X multiplied by 2 plus 5. Got it? Number 4. Multiply the result you've got by 50. Oops, this is getting a bit more complicated. Where's my calculator? So X multiplied by 2 plus 5, and all this multiplied by 50. Okay. Number 5. And now, your date of birth comes into play. If you have already celebrated your birthday this year, add 1,768 to your final result. And if this magnificent event is still ahead, add 1,767. Number 6. Now, you're supposed to have a four-figure number. If you don't, something has gone terribly wrong. Check your calculations again. You need to subtract the year of your birth from your final result. After you've done this, you get a three-digit number. The first digit is the number you chose at the beginning, and the following two digits are your age. If you haven't made any mistakes in your calculation, you'll have the right answer. Wow, <laughs> that's absolutely astonishing! How does it work? Well, let's do this math together. So, I need to pick one number from 1 to 9. Well, my favorite number is 5, so that's what I'll opt for. Now, I should multiply 5 by 2. 5 times 2 gives me 10. Let me add 5 to my result. 10 plus 5 makes 15. Give me a second, I'll just uh, grab my calculator here. I can't multiply 15 times 50 without using one. Okay, here we go. 15 times 50 equals 750. What's next? Oh, right. I already had my birthday this year. This means I need to add 1,768 to 750. Done. This is 2,518. Finally, I'm supposed to subtract the year of my birth from the final result. Okay, 2,518 minus 1,986 is 532. That's fantastic! 5 is the number I chose in the beginning, and I'm indeed 32 years old. At least for this example. <laughs> hey, do you have any idea how it works? If so, sound off in the comments below. Remember to hit the like button and share this video with your friends. For more magic, join us on the Bright Side of Life by subscribing to this channel.